Hello class, how are you today? Excellent. Today we are going to learn something that it looks like magic, all right? But before that, here, this is my my snack of today. What do you think of it? It's really nice, right? Do you want some? Here, I'm going to roll it to you and you are going to take Oh, it looks like it doesn't want to go with you. <laughs> okay, this is called a rollback can. And it's, and it's really amazing how it works. Okay, so today we're going to, I'm going to help you to do one of this. And you're going to learn something about physics. Okay, so these are the materials you're going to need. All right, these are the materials you are going to need for this class, okay? As we discussed uh, in the previous class, we're going to need tape, nails, a lot of coins, I have here my coins, a rubber band, a can of Pringles, and super important, the hair clip this is going to be super important for this activity okay so don't forget to have one of this and let's begin first thing you need you want to do is grab all the coins you, you can have but remember they need to be almost the same size for example all uh, coins of five pesos or all the coins of one peso and 50 cents right Let's start by adding two. Like that. Okay. Here are one. Here I have 15, 15 pesos. Okay. Next, you want to use the tape to make a little package. Okay. So, carefully we're going to make a package with these coins And we're going to need more tape. Okay. Basically, what you want to do is to make a package so all the coins stay together. Okay, like this. Okay, really well secure, like that, right? Now, next step is to take one of the rubber bands and put it on the top, like this. And we're going to use more tape, right? To tape it to the package of coins, to the pack of coins. You want to make it to be really on the center, right? Like that. Okay. Now that we have this package with the rubber band, we're going to leave it on the side. And we're going to use, with the help of your parents, we're going to make a hole here and another one right here on the bottom, on the center, okay? Let's do it very carefully. I'm going to use these uh, pliers to Okay, 
there we have a hole okay now one on the top there we go okay so now we have a hole here and another one on the bottom this is the tricky part because we need to pass this through this hole and the other part through the bottom hole if you need to you can make the holes bigger okay so the rubber band can pass through all right right and now is the time for use the hair clip like this one okay what you want to do is pass it through here what you want to do is this pass it through here and like this is going to be so much easier to do it okay you just need to pass both through the hole and there you have it okay you take the clip and you add the nail or the the paper clip okay and this is for to prevent that then that the rubber band goes off okay okay now the other the other side the same procedure you pass it through and you pass it through and once it comes out like this you want to put the nail or the paper clip right there you want to put the nail or the or the the nail or the paper clip right through it and now we can take this hair clip like that okay and now it's here and it's also here <laughs> and now and now if I push it it's going to come back check it out what do you think Kim, do you want some? Yes. All right, here we go. <laughs> so what is going on? Well, it turns out that since the rubber band is having some weight, the can is rolling, but but the coins are not moving. So what is going on is that the rubber band is doing this. And when the force is stops, then it starts untangling and that forces the can to move to the other side. Excellent, right? Okay, class. Don't forget to send me pictures of your experiment. I know this is kind of difficult. This experiment is a little bit more difficult, but I know you can do it. Okay? So, as always, but let me know in the comments what do you think about this experiment. If you don't find the materials you need, don't worry. Write down in the comments what do you think of the experiment and why do you think it's working. Okay? All right, class. Take care, be safe, and I see you in the next video. Bye-bye.